I put whether you are buying a new home, renting a new apartment, or just looking to better protect your home, there are some simple things you can do to keep you safe. Lance Ross from A1 Lock Service is here to show us why changing your locks is so important. And Lance, I guess, for, uh, besides the obvious question, why is it so important for folks to change their locks? Well, you want to change your locks, especially in case uh, anybody loses the key, you get any new property. And there's any life-changing event in your life, sort of like a, a divorce or anything like that. You want to make sure that you're safe, your family is safe, and that's the main, main uh, important thing. Whose responsibility is it, I suppose, in an apartment situation to get the locks changed, get new keys for the next tenant that's coming in so the old tenant doesn't you know, keep those keys and maybe come back in for some reason? Right. If you're in an apartment, it's up to the landlord to change the locks on the apartment. What is the, you've obviously brought some uh, visual aids. We love visual aids. <laughs> what are some of the different grades of locks that you can show us? Okay, this is what your, your do-it-yourself stores. These are some of the most uh, inexpensive locks you can buy, and this is one of the boats. And the boat is the main thing that locks the, the door to the frame, okay? That is what you got when you buy it at the do-it-yourself store. It's that's just not, great. You that's, just... This is, that's not very secure. And these are both the same kind of boats, okay? So this, is that just no good? It's... It's, that's why it's inexpensive. That's why people call and say, well, I can get this at the do-it-yourself store for this price. I'm like, and this is what you get. This is what you're buying. Okay, this is a locksmith grade lock. This is what we sell because we have to stand behind our product. I'm not going to put this on and come back next week and have to pay again to have my guy come out there and fix it. This is solid. This is the heaviest grade lock we sell. It's a high security lock like this one here. Solid. You don't want something like this on your house. See? No kidding. Just, this just bends. I mean, just, that's simple. That's, that's what you have, junk right there. Also, these are most people see as a single cylinder's thumb turns. The people in the comedy call it the flippy deal. I have the flippy deal on my lock. Well, this is the flippy deal. If you have uh, doors on your house, you do not want the flippy deal on there. Because if a thief breaks into your house through the through window, he's going to say, well, I'm going to grab a TV. I'm going to go out the door because the flippy deal will let him out. If you have a double center dead boat with the key out, he cannot get out of your house. Also, you'll notice on a, a locksmith grade, there are no exposed screws. So if he comes in with a screwdriver thinking he can take it apart, it's not happening. Listen, the thieves are pretty clever. I mean, you can pull yes. the locks you want. I mean, isn't there always a way to get in? I hate to give any tips to bad guys, but is there any foolproof method to keep somebody out? Well, the bad thing about it is we're always trying to stay a step ahead. So whatever we come out with, they're always trying to figure out a way to, to get through it. All you can do is be uh, call a locksmith, call you a good, reputable locksmith, and talk to them. We're more than happy to talk to anything, anybody about any questions. There was a new trend. I saw it online. A reporter had done a story on lock bumping, where yes. they basically saw the key down, yes. put it in a lock, and then, and it just, it was amazing. Been around forever. It, is, are these locks susceptible to that? It's been around forever. This one right here, uh, if you spend the time and you, and, you, and you go through it, you can learn how to bump a lock, but... If you go with a high security lock, this is what I have on my house. It's a high security lock. You cannot buy this key. You have to come through a locksmith to buy the key, so you won't be able to cut it down and do any bumping. As you can tell, they don't look normal. It's, it's totally different from this here. Right. That's how you keep the bumpers out, because they cannot get the key to your house. What kind of price points are we talking about? You've got the, the, the least expensive one here, which right. you said is, is just not worth it. You get it to do it yourself stores, right. This one right here is going to cost you a locksmith grade lock, and it's going to cost you about $20 more dollars than the do-it-yourself locks. The high-security locks, these right here run around between $250 and $300. But what we can do is I can get you high-security cylinders, put them on a locksmith-grade lock, and save you $100. Nice. Yes. Everybody likes to save money, right? Right. And all you have to do is just find you, a, like I said, a good lock, a licensed locksmith. We have so many locksmiths out there right now that are not licensed. That are just running around and not, not necessarily if, doing quality If you work. call a company yeah. and someone shows up in a car, a beat-up truck, or a van with no signage or no license number on it, send them home. Call A1, Lock Service. Call A1. Lance from A1. Appreciate yes, your time. Hey, Good advice. I enjoyed it. Thanks for Good having me Good information. Out here. Very good. All right.